This is a laboratory inside the National Center for Atmospheric Research in Boulder, Colorado. And if you're wondering why I'm dressed like this, well, this is the warm part of the lab. And this is what they call the cold lab, which they typically keep at about minus eight degrees Fahrenheit. And the reason for that is when they're in here, they're studying hail, hailstones like this. And this actually came from a unique research project this summer called Project Ice Chip, where these researchers go out into the middle of these crazy hailstorms, they collect hailstones like this, and then they analyze them here in this lab. And they're doing this because hail causes billions of dollars in damages every year to homes, to cars, and to crops. And so by better understanding how hail forms and what kind of thunderstorms can cause hail to fall, that hopefully can lead to better weather forecasts and better predictions of extreme hail events. And that's crucial because with climate change, these researchers say that these severe thunderstorms are actually getting stronger. They're capable of producing larger hail, up to 75% larger, and obviously that hail can be even more damaging than something like this.